<clears throat> Evening ladies and gents and we are at the Royal Exchange. A pretty impressive building. I think you'll agree. Over there is the Bank of England. That building we're looking at there, that's the Bank of England. The Royal Exchange. That's what I said about before, wasn't it? There, when Thomas Gresham founded it, he called it the Bourse, and uh, Queen Elizabeth I didn't like that. She thought it sounded too Dutch, so she decreed that it should be called the Royal Exchange. It's very impressive. Massage chair. <laughs> Got Fortnum and Masons there. <clears throat> well, this is most interesting. I like this kind of thing. I'm try not to uh, catch anyone eating. Yeah, it goes further on in here. There's more books, goes out there. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it really. This wasn't going to be a long one, just wanted to show you because it's a pretty splendid building like, architecturally. Fortnum and Masons there. Stairs are going there. Is that much? I don't know if it's That will pretty much do us because it's obviously quite busy and I don't want to be recording people eating. Eating, rather. But the smell of lilies in here is very, very strong. I should show you more of the outside of the building, of course. So, dog friends.
this is every bit a Roman or a copy of a Roman building anyways number two the Royal Exchange it's pretty damn impressive isn't it eh? our great head chief engineer city and south london railway inventor of the traveling shield that made possible the cutting of the tunnels of london's deep level system the tube to you and i some kind here I assume in memory of the officers non-commissioned officers and men of London who served their king and empire in the great war 1914-1918 and you've got for the second world war there it was raised by a public subscription Sorry. And as I say, that is the Bank of England there. We'll be doing the museum of that one soon. Area. It's got some pretty impressive buildings in it, as you'll agree. Duke of Wellington, this one is. Correct to June 1844. Wellington Royal Exchange Bank of England and all the new buildings of the city around it this is the commercial hub we're on Fred Needle Street by the way ladies and gents which is a very very another very old street and Bank Station the old one it's another lovely old building over there I found another new church to um, investigate soon so yeah Take care all, hope you all found this interesting. If you did, please give it a like and a share. Thanks very much for watching. Here we are, the man himself, Thomas Gresham, who founded the Royal Exchange. Yeah, just a portrait of him shown in 1544. And the next little bit will just be some information on him. Here we are, so Thomas Gresham, the Elder.
if you wish to read more on Sir Thomas Gresham, just go on to Wikipedia or your search engine of choice and never read up on him because it's quite a lot. Hope you all found that interesting. If you did, please give it a like and a share.